Here in the metro, a school district is getting creative to find more staff members to fill shortages. Ellen Gala shows us how Fridley Public Schools is expanding recruiting efforts on a global scale. I have one question for you. Two months ago, 40-year-old Cheryl Opinio was living in the Philippines, where she'd been working as an elementary school teacher for 15 years. Today, she's teaching high school as a full-time sub in Fridley, Minnesota. They trust me? They believe in me? Yes? Cheryl's part of a new international program launched by Fridley Public Schools to help fill many of the empty positions in their schools. How did you feel? Positions that range from classroom teachers to building maintenance. I have never seen staffing shortages like I've seen since the last three to four years. What that reality is then is you have students in classes whose needs aren't met. Superintendent Brenda Lewis says it's a concept she brought with her from her previous district in Grand Forks, North Dakota. They work with an agency to find international teachers who are certified and qualified, as well as the U.S. Department of Labor to get them visas. Then her staff helps with everything from housing to carpools. When they come, they literally have their bed made, shower curtain, case of water, food in the fridge. What else? Cheryl says she was open to moving anywhere in the U.S. because it meant more opportunity. She sends money back home to her brothers. And she said she was thrilled that her job was in Minnesota because... I wanted to see the Mississippi River. <laughs> and so far, it's a program that's doing more than just filling vacancies. And it's benefiting more than just the students. Right now, staying in Fridley Public School, it feels like this is my home. Uh, I am in you know, my own home. I love it. Currently, there are 14 international staff members working here in the district, with 17 more on the way. Reporting in Fridley, Ellen Gallus, 5 Eyewitness News.